G'day and welcome back, Faintly Saintly here, and this is Mini Shoot Adventures. And if you joined me in the last episode, we just beat the third boss dungeon after hitching a ride with a big uh, giant turtle and unlocked the ability to float on water, which will unlock numerous paths for us, which is fantastic. Um, and I'm just trying to remember, we did have an extra NPC in this cave here who looks at ancient tablets for us. We did find one and it just seemed to unlock a bit of lore. Which was nice, but I don't think we have anything new for him. Which is fine. And uh, this guy heals. This guy looks at maps. So I don't think we have any more map fragments yet. He will sell overall completion marker. But I think we're saving for the next level of gun, which we're very close to. Level 5. And do we have any scarabs? We've got two scarabs. The next one will get us a heart piece. Okay, let's have a look where we're up to. So we've explored most of this. We haven't gone this way down through the forest here. And the final boss is obviously up there. Well, the fourth boss, I should say. Maybe not final. I feel like this uh, little distress signal over here was also hidden behind some water. So we do have access to a few new paths since we've unlocked the water ability which was called Surf, which lets us travel over water. All right, let's make a move. I'm going to head, whoops, just wasted my shield ability. I'm going to recharge up before I head out. I'm going to cruise on down. A bit like when we got the um, super shot where it unlocked a whole bunch of paths. I know there was a whole lot of rocks and cracked walls I was going to come back to, but it's just remembering where they all were. And uh, yeah, just the same. I know there was a whole bunch of things hidden behind little paths of water, which I can now cross, but it's just a matter of remembering how to get back to them and, and where, where to find them. But we will find them in due time, I'm sure. Where am I going here? I think that's right. Yeah, I'm going to try and spin around here and get to this little distress signal in the forest. Okay, so one boss at least left to fight, possibly two. I'm, I'm guessing if it's going to follow the Zelda trajectory, the four bosses will unlock a, a final boss. So at least one boss to fight. We've got a few little unfinished races and things out there in the caves. I was not very good at racing. <laughs> and here we go. We've unlocked or rescued a new NPC. And he's going to run home. And if there's nothing else to look at around here, I might just teleport back and join him. Looks like there's nothing else. This game is quite good at hiding secrets. So I'd just like to make sure. Maybe behind the tree, I'll just have a quick squeeze. Nope, oh, okay. Needs my teleport home ability. Let's see what this NPC does for us. There he is. Hiding up there. What do you do, buddy? He's playing music, are you? Okay, all right. You do you, pal. Let's have a look. Now this tower, it looks like that's hidden behind some water, so maybe I can get to that as well. I'm going to go down to the right and then straight down. I'm just going to use this opportunity to, to clear up a few loose ends. And just continue to run directly into bullets. Where am I? So if you go straight down. Oh, just unlock the shortcut. What is this? Have I not been here before? Another bloody bush monster. 
All right, I'm much more equipped to deal with these now. If I pay attention, that is. That'd be cheeky. I need to remember to use my shield powers, actually. I was terrible at remembering I have those. Not that it matters. Just need to kill this little struggle here. There we go. Now, what is this? Vengeful Talisman sends a wave of powerful bullets in all around you whenever you get hit. That's pretty good. So where was I? On my way. How good's this? On the water. Lovely. Oh, they're the spirits. Right, they're the little guys I race, so I need to race. I've only beaten one race. So I need to go and find them all. Apparently there's eight of them. And that'll open the way there. Hmm, that's a bit of a worry. Now what is this tree? I think I check that out as well. While I'm down here. I think I should better get to it this way. Me or did the uh, music stop? Feeling very quiet. Oh, lovely. Some coins, always welcome. Hey, what have we got here? Restoration Enhancer. Improves Crystal's Restoration, reducing 10% of the amount needed to level up. Increase maximum amount of energy. Or another Ancient Tablet. These are cheap. I'm going to get these, actually. It'll delay getting the weapon upgrade, but I think it's worth it. This one purely for just completion sake. I don't think it's going to be that helpful. But the battery, definitely I want. More energy is always great. Ah, a little secret there. What have we got in here? Another race. Okay. Alright. I've got five points. I can put them in boost speed. Does power of time work in a race? Feels like cheating. It does though. Well, might not help me though, the way I'm going. Does that count or is he going to get angry at me? I know he was. Quite happy with that. Okay. I'll take it. I feel dirty <laughs> for slowing down time and completely cheating. But that is fine with me, I suppose. Where are we going? What's this little cave? Oh, there's a battery up there. First off, have I been here? I need to come out from the other side. Okay, so that's an exit. To something. Let's check a little map here. Hmm. 
There's a way to fall down somewhere up here. Aha. That's really good. That's two extra batteries I've got in about two minutes, which is fantastic. Those batteries control how long I can boost with my extra speed, and also it controls my super shots there, so... Always welcome. I'm just looking for any other secrets in the water. There has to be a way to fall down into that cave somehow. So impatient there. Hmm. It is so nice not having to worry about the water. Can we go this way or up? Let's see where it leads. This might be the cave. Hmm. Where am I? Oh, I've been here. I've been here. So, is the rest of that cave explored as well? Oh, there is a distress signal there. I'll, I'll allow myself to get distracted and then forget to go back for that, I'm sure. Need to drive over that water, I believe. What is that hole? Oh, no, I need to focus. <laughs> focus on one thing at a time, otherwise I'll just do nothing. And if, like when I play Breath of the Wild, you, you know, set off on an adventure, then you see something along the way, so you get distracted and go do that, and then you see something else, and then you end up on the other side of the world, and you think, what was I doing again? That could just be my brain, though. Oh, there we go. A little power where I shoot bullets after taking damage. Could come in handy. Now, if those bullets, like, destroyed enemy bullets, that would be amazing. A little level up there. Kill this guy. Jeez. Taking some horrible damage. Whoa. Okay, okay, okay. Need to focus up. And then tile a little bit. Lovely. Oh, jeez. Thank you for the health back. Need to remember to use my shield power. Always forget. Oh, jeez. Ah, oh, okay, I forgot those bullets kill you instantly. Ah, oh, and I'm now pushing the wrong button. I'm trying to press uh, dash, not shield, but anyway. Can I run? No, I cannot. I need to be smart about that one, not just rush through. I don't have any power left now for my abilities, so... Ah, oh, here we go. 
quick little recharge there. So this will be the one for the time control, I think. This one here, maybe. It, I need to, <laughs> I need to give it a second to kick in. Ah, oh, getting impatient. Quick recharge. I do know how to make the uh, simple things look difficult, don't I? Dodge that and just run. There we go. Right, and we get to save this fella. Who's trapped in the corruption. Achievement unlocked. I missed you all, free all your friends. So he was the last distress signal. Which is nice. So where am I? There. I was just going to go back into that cave just to see if that other path was anything interesting. And then I will move right along. Whoops, you're all back. I remember what that hole was. Tempted. Might as well just fall down into space. That's fine too. And I'll just keep doing it. Was it there? No. Yes, maybe. I'm so bad with directions. <laughs> Where did I go? Man, I'm just way off course at the moment. That's where I just was. And this is the corruption town, which is not where I wanted to be. Tell you what, zero internal GPS. As I've mentioned, I just have no sense of direction or space. But I'm trying to go back to whatever cave I was in. I just cannot remember for life of me how I got in. This looks familiar. Maybe it was this way. There it was. Okay. They're all back from the dead. And that's the path I took last time, but I don't want to do that this time. I want to go up. I believe. Let's see what's up here. Okay. Okay, I've already done it. Oh, a bit rude. How have I done this path? Back in Corruption Town. Oh, dear Lord. <laughs> I apologise. This must be very frustrating if you've... Uh, Watch my previous episode, you'll be sitting there face palming. Alright, I might as well just fall down this hole up here as well. I'm curious to see if I've done that. Because in the end, there was that little cave that I need to find a way into. I think I might be a bit too far away from that now, though. Go back in. Now where am I? Up there. Okay, there is one cave up here I haven't been to. As confirmed by the map. So I'm not going to be forgetful. Where was that? Just south. 
Nothing in the water though, is there? No. There should be a cave that I haven't completed, and maybe I can do this now. Oh, it's a race. I'm not using my time cheat this time because I've got no power. He's got his cheat of actually knowing where the path is. I think it's only fair. Ah, uh, blew it. Jeez, it's a long one. Awful considering. But for completion, I do need to win this, don't I? So I'm going to go charge my time hour. And I'm just going to cheat. Whoa. If there is a crystal around here somewhere. Where would a crystal be? Oh, can't go in that water apparently. Fine with me. Oh, it's this guy. I wonder if I can kill him now. I know I found him early on in the run. But I just did not have the firepower. There we go. That's nice. Thank you for the coins. Here we go. Fully charged. Time to cheat. I don't think it's going to be enough. No good under this sort of pressure. <laughs> Come on. Oh, was enough. Alrighty, we'll take that and get the hell out of here. All right, I need to progress a bit, so I'm going to move on. I'm going to go back home. I'm going to see what that last little uh, friendly fellow I rescued will do for me. I think he might be in this house. What is this? Like my family. Finding your place. Reunite the family. There we go. What did I get? Enchanted heart. 15% chance to dodge a hit. That's cool. Alright, see you fam.
Got places to be. All right. Give me a heal, please. Enough of that. Where am I going? Look at all these unexplored caves over here. How do I get up there? I can't pass that barrier. I can't cross this water. Must be something up here, maybe. Now that I can just freely scoot across there, that's amazing. It's just a graveyard. Oh, got me. Please go away. Bloody everywhere. A bit crazy out here. Little oh, scarab. Gotcha. All right, now I've got three of those. I can trade those in for a heart container. Should be helpful. All right, need to get you from behind. Really, nothing in there. Surely that's not a blocked path. Maybe it is. Hello, what's this? What is that? Um, interesting. Do I need to go to all the big gravestones and kill these things? Are they corrupted spirits or something? Ah, oh, yes. One, two, three. There's another one, and this will be it. Buzz off. Kind of in the middle of something here. There we go. Right. Don't know if there's any point to destroying all of them. Okay. May as well be thorough. What are these holes, I wonder? Another ancient tablet. Oops. Not going to reset, will it? No. All right, so I've got two of these now. I think I can take back to that uh, NPC for a bit of lore, a bit of exposition. Okay, here we go. All the way down. Still going. What is this? Ouch. Survivor fall from the fifth floor. This is the achievement I just got. Okay, and a path is open. Are these crumbled old buildings destroyable? No. 
Where am I? It won't show me, will it? Is that the path I want to go in, or should I explore? Oh, no, I think I've been here. But obviously wouldn't have been able to follow this path. Oh, look who it is. The race. Where am I going? Where am I going? Oh no, <laughs> that's not good. Oh, I did it again. Stay away from me. Oh, that was lucky. Very lucky. Ah, uh, yes, and this is the place I saw earlier. Full of delicious leveling crystals. Uh, I'll open this wall. And I'll just see what else is in this door. Oh, that might be back into the cave to retry, right? Yes. Okay. Well, look, I'm not uh, any closer to the next boss, but it has been productive. All the way back here now. But that answers the question of what's inside that cave. So there we go. Found that by complete chance <laughs> in an unconnected part of the map. But the good news is I'm back home so I can check in. Oh, actually, can I afford this gun now? Not quite. Check in with this mate here. Ancient tablet, please. Tell me about it. And I had two, didn't I? Yes. When the colossal beasts attacked, a chosen was called upon. Primordial powers were granted, and the world trembled with the battle. Banished from the crystal world, animated by resentment, the unchosen hid in the abyss and cherished the fruit of usurpation. Wouldn't expect this to be the kind of game that has that kind of lore and exposition, but they're certainly building a world. Certainly something to it. Um, now what? I did have a map fragment. No, I didn't. Ah, oh, I had the scarab. That's right. Okay, so I'm just one quarter of a heart piece off a whole new heart container, which is fantastic. There's a little cave up there I haven't been in. Might as well just turn this, turn this into a little uh, catch-up session on... Oh. Yeah, game just had a wee little crash, but uh, as I was saying, I may as well just turn this into a little catch up session just to get to some of these caves and things that I've not been able to access or that I've left laying around. If I can, is that it there? No, it's not, not even what I was looking at, although there's one up here as well. Ah, yes, okay, I remember this. But there are lanterns that you can access from different places. And I've got one left to go. And that'll unlock, unlock the scarab key, whatever that is. I think it was a scarab key. Where was that cave? This might have been it. Ah, and that's why it's incomplete. Okay. Hmm. 
We'll see if there's anything new I can do now that I have a few more abilities. No, but it will take me all the way back to the start. There will be a little cave somewhere and it could be... There's a hole up there. There's one, two, three. Plenty to choose from. There's one down here even. One there. I'll check out one more. And then I might call it a day. Is this the one? Yes. But there's something in here that I haven't been able to do before. Somewhere. I'll happily take those coins. Thank you. Ah, uh, race. Relatively straightforward. Jeez, he took his time. Done. Now let me out of here. Right, okay. What is that? Mini boss dungeon, maybe? Oh, that's right. I couldn't get to it because it's deep water. Oops. Can I? No, I can't do my little dodge on the water. That one. I can't really dodge from this side either. Nearly. Oh, I can. Interesting. Points, thank you. Here we go. Well, that is lovely. What does this do for me? Ah... Love to see that. That's the fourth uh, quarter heart piece that I need. Beautiful. Lovely, that's helpful. It's worth coming down here. There was a little something up there, wasn't there? I'm just going to check that out quickly. This is it. Have I been here before? Another race. I haven't had a chance to recharge my cheaty time powers, so I will do that first, I think. We're going to find a place nearby. Get out of here. Run all the way back home. No worries. I'm going to knock off a few of these races now. That's going to be very helpful. Why are the corrupt enemies spawning right near my home base? I don't recall that being a thing. 
Oops, it's clicked off the screen. Take these out one by one and just clear up some of these bloody bullets. A little bit easier. I don't understand. Are they is it just because I've progressed that they've turned corrupt, or have they always been there? What is this? Is there anything down here? Nothing new. Okay. All right, back up to the race. Oh no. Oh no. I surrender. I surrender. Let me go. May have misjudged what that uh, deep water was. <laughs> Slight miscalculation there. It's nice being out of boost for so long. Whoa. Oh, that's it, wasn't it? All right, let's try this again, and this time be less stupid. Thought I could dash over that, but completely forgot that I cannot dash on water. I'm out of boost, that's not good. go. Done. Nice. Well, it's certainly been a productive session. Smashed out some races, got some heart containers, reunited my family and rescued all the NPCs. Got some good powers for the, my trouble. Well, some badges, talismans, I guess. Which is always very good. I'm nearly able to afford the level 5 gun, which will be fantastic. Uh, here we go. I've got two races to go. I had one at the start of the episode, so that's uh, very handy. And I've got eight points to spend. I could upgrade my damage very soon. There is still another unlockable power that I haven't got yet here as well, so that'll be interesting to see what that is. But I might wrap it up here and leave it there for the episode. So thank you for watching. If you like this and want to see more, please consider subscribing. It helps me out a lot and keeps you in the loop when new videos drop. I cover games like this in series, but also cover indie games and demos that are coming out just to shine a bit of a spotlight on them and explore them and um, and to see what's what's out there and see what's good. So if that's something that interests you, um, yeah, chuck me a follow. It really helps out. And uh, if you have any game suggestions or feedback, let me know in the comments below and I'll do my best to get back to you every time. So thanks again for watching and I will see you next time.